Okay, San Francisco, California is where we go for this fine beer. I'm wearing my Flyers orange shirt in honor of 21st Amendment's Brew Free or Die Blood Orange IPA. Uh, now, this is a 7% ABV IP IPA, kind of taking advantage of the uh, the Blood Orange IPA craze uh, lately. Seems like a lot of these uh, breweries are doing uh, Blood Orange brewed uh, India Pale Ales. Of course, this is... Uh, you know, you got your Mount Rushmore up here, just uh, in an orange twinge. It's been rotating since it looks like the fall of 2016. It's got 70 IBUs. It was brewed with Regal Blood Oranges with a base of Brew Free or Die IPA, which is, I guess, the flagship IPA of 21st Amendment. I don't remember if we reviewed that or not. I'd have to look back at my notes and see if we did, and back at the YouTube notes, too. I probably could just search YouTube before I did this review, but I didn't. Um... They added additional citra hops to complement the oranges, so that's the only change, other than the obvious change of blood orange brewed beer that they made to brew for your dye. It's got four hop varieties, a dry hopped with citra, mosaic, and chinook. Flavored hops are centennial and citra. Bittering hops, uh, CTZ, and malts are two-row pale, Munich, and caramalt. So let's open up the can that we got. I'm going to see what we pour into this pint glass. Uh, do we see an orange pour? Yes, we do. We see a very orange pour in keeping with the blood orange theme. And I'll pour it all the way up here. You can see through. A little bit see-through. Um, but it looks like there's uh, a lot going on. A bit of cloudy, as you may or may not be able to see. Uh, nice head on it. Probably about two fingers or so. So let's get the aroma now of blood orange IPA from 21st Amendment. Very orangey. Yeah, just getting that uh, very sun-kissed kind of uh, smell. Almost like orange juice, in a way. But man, the citrus is just right there. There's really nothing else in this, uh, aroma-wise, than the citrus that we're getting. So let's dig in here and see what we got with 21st Amendment Brew Free or Die Blood Orange IPA. Mm. This is a blood orange bomb. Uh, really, it, 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 the orange just encapsulates you as soon as you taste this. It's almost like orange juice beer, uh, and I mean that in a good way. It's really, really well crafted, and uh, doesn't really have too much of a bittering... Um, after effect either this is seven percent abv so it's kind of on the border between a regular ipa and a double ipa it is listed as a regular ipa i would say anything above a 7.5 would definitely be a double oh man this tastes good i'm going to go ahead and uh, give a perfect score for uh, blood orange ipa from 21st amendment brew for your die uh 10 out of 10 uh really really well devised well done and well crafted so um, we did good, and uh, looking forward to maybe trying some more of this in the future, so that's 10 out of 10.